So welcome to this video. My name is Sanjay Prakash Pradhan and I am a Microsoft Certified Trainer. In this video we will see how we can embed this Power BI report or dashboard in uh, model driven apps or any model driven apps like Sales Hub or any Dynamics 365 apps. right? So to do that what you have to do the first thing is you have to enable Power BI embedding services in settings. Go to power apps and click on advanced settings and in the advanced settings you have to go to administration and in the administration you have to go to system settings system settings has many options to enable for there is an option called as reporting in the reporting you have to enable the power bi embedding services so that you can create reports or dashboards that will connect to power bi Go to here in the administration and in the administration click on system settings and in the system settings you will find there is a tab called as reporting by default it is no but you have to click it yes you can see allow power bi visualization embedding keep it yes and click on ok now this is the first step the next step is go to power apps and create a solution i want to create a new solution say and to create a solution for let's say power bi solution and choose your publisher let me choose any publisher click on create and this solution i will open it in modern solution design designer screen and here i will click on new and choose dashboard and click on power bi embedded when you choose power bi embedded it is asking to give a name of the embedded dashboard i want to give a name let's say account dashboard power bi right now you can embed either a report or a dashboard from power bi inside your uh, power apps or in uh, model driven apps so i want to use a power bi dashboard as i have already created choose power bi dashboard or you can choose report if you choose report you can define your workspace and then you can define your uh, report here right now if i want to use dashboard i can use power bi dashboard and the dashboard is available here right account power bi dashboard i have created and choose this dashboard can you see that the name of the dashboard is account power bi dashboard right now it is chosen here click on save now I have created a an embedded Power BI dashboard inside my solution. Now I want to display this embedded Power BI report or dashboard on a can on a uh, power uh, on a Power Apps model driven apps called a Sales Hub. So if you open Sales Hub, let me click on Add Existing and click on Apps model driven apps. Choose Sales Hub, or I want to display in Customer Service. So choose Customer Service Hub and click add now the model driven app will be added to your uh, solution now open this customer service hub app and click on the sitemap right before that you have to click on this dashboard and if you scroll down all the way you will find there is a section called as power bi embedded dashboards i want to embed the dashboard that i have already created called as account dashboard power bi enable this and click on save I want to display this dashboard as a sub area so click on this sitemap and drag a sub area inside the group that you want to display right otherwise I can use this dashboard already having a dashboard and this dashboard will always uh, have uh, always display all the dashboards right so I can click on go back. I don't want to add another sub area. The same dashboard in the sitemap link will also di display for me. Click on save and publish. If you want to add another dash another uh, sub area, you can add it and connect. Otherwise, the existing dashboard link will also list out your new Power BI dashboard that you have just created. Now click on publish once you publish it will open the now when you click on play button it will open the customer service shop and here you will find your dashboard 
right this is the embedded dashboard that i have created in the solution and which has been already created in power bi desktop and published in power bi online now click on this account dashboard now this account dashboard will now render the report that i have created and it will refresh every 10 seconds right and if you click on the account name the contact grid will also be updated accordingly right because both are related normally it is a best practice that do not keep the refresh timing every 10 seconds it is not a bit uh, good practice because it will keep loading uh, every time so what i will do i'll go to this report i'll go to the dashboard and go to this report and i'll just change the refresh uh, refresh timing is uh, 10 minutes every 10 minutes it will refresh save it now go here and try to refresh it press ctrl f5 to load properly now this is the power bi desktop dashboard that i have created and it is refreshing data let me create a new account and we'll see whether it is updating or not let me create a new account let's say i'm giving account age asta account and i'll save it i'll just use a annual revenue for example let's say six six thousand and save it and i'll go to create some contacts for this account related contacts i'll associate some contacts say contact one and same keep it for example contact one contact one save and close and also i will add another contact for example and this time i will use contact two and contact two and seven close so what i have done i have created a contact uh, account whose name is asta account and i have associated two account two contacts for this account right so let us go here in the dashboard and just go to account dashboard to check if my data is populating or not in the dashboard just refresh all now if you search here it is trying to refresh and here also you will find your account it's not refreshing still it is refreshing can you see that there is a loader it is running and it is trying to refresh you have to wait for some seconds once the refresh is automatically completed i can see the uh, data the recent data in my power bi dashboard okay let us wait for some seconds now after refresh if you check the dashboard you can see here in this list the new account is added and if you click this for all the related contacts for this account will be updated here because this both table are related and it is account and this is contact right and also this account is displaying in this uh, revenue list whatever revenue you have uh, revenue you have added it is updating here can you see that so this is the account that is displaying here and uh, here it is updating it will take some time but it will display all the contacts which are associated with this account okay so this is how you can create uh, you know power bi uh, reports or dashboards using power bi desktop in my last video you can see you have seen and uh, in this video you have seen how that power bi reports and dashboards can be embedded inside any power apps that you can think of it is maybe model driven app it may be uh, anything you can think of even in power portal also you can uh, display this right so as per need as per business need you have to do that so thank you for watching this video and uh, if you have not subscribed please subscribe and i will come with my next video uh, in this channel thank you see you then Thank you.